Formula SAE is a project management and engineering design competition to build a small uh, Formula style race car. I started in this program when I was a freshman uh, five years ago um, simply because I love uh, racing, uh, driving, and um, motorsports engineering, making cars go faster on track. Throughout the whole process I got to learn a lot more, uh, but I primarily started because I love racing. design, manufacture, and build a new formula-style race car. Um, we take it all the way from uh, design inception all the way through to testing. Uh, it is all a student-run, student-organized group at the University of Pittsburgh. Uh, every year our main competition is at Michigan International Speedway where we compete against 120 teams that come from all over the world. The car is well and above anything that is available on the road. Um, it's a true race car. It's a thoroughbred. It's built for short, tight autocross courses. Um, when you get it out on the bigger stuff, uh, it's very unstable. Um, it's got a lot of power. The, it only weighs 450 pounds uh, without a driver. And with uh, 85 horsepower, the power to weight ratio um, you know, brings it up into the realm of uh, high-end uh, sports cars and supercars. Um, so zero to 60 is three and a half. So um, first time any new driver puts their foot down in one of the cars, you know, their eyes light up and uh, they're thrown back in the seat and they're not expecting, um, you know, the full pull of the engine. Uh, but it's, uh, it's an absolute blast to drive. Um, once you get them on the limit, they always do have some handling characteristics that you have to, you know, you have to debug because um, they're designed by students and, you know, this is in many cases the first or second time anybody's ever, any of the students have ever looked at uh, suspension design. So in order to get the car set up and handling nicely, um, you have to do a lot of tuning out on track as well. So the, the best part for me about being a driver is pushing the car on track um, and also coming back and being able to say, okay, we need to make these changes in order to make the car faster. It's all about getting the team to work together, um, planning the process, and getting real hands-on engineering experience like you would in the field. Because you can't, you can't do this kind of stuff in the classroom. You, know, you can't design something, go out, test it, break it, redesign it because you learned why it broke in the first place, and, and actually get to apply real, real engineering skills. Employers especially love to see FSA on a resume because we are able to take that project from the beginning to the end through all the steps and we're able to keep it for the most part in budget. <laughs> This is the first class lap.